Aloha, I'm Hawaii Wedding Officiant Kim Cronella and I have a story time for you today. In Hawaii, the tradition of giving lays on a wedding day is a popular tradition. It symbolizes the couple giving themselves to one another and each couple will adorn uh, the other with a lay. It can be a fresh lay or it can be a silk lay, um, but it is a very popular tradition here in Hawaii. I had a couple that um, I was working with, uh, it was a military couple, and the groom was uh, deployed, the bride did all the planning herself, and she wanted to have a lay exchange as part of their ceremony. So it's one of the things that I incorporated in, they purchased some beautiful lays for their ceremony. They had a big celebration with about 100 guests and attendants and everything, and the wedding ceremony started, uh, everybody gets up in front, and it the lay exchange typically happens right in the beginning of the ceremony. And I start talking about doing the lay exchange, and they just start looking around and looking at each other, and they had forgotten the lays back in the dressing room area. This particular venue had a bride and groom suite for them to get dressed in before the ceremony, and unfortunately, they left the lays back there. They were already standing in front of all of their guests, and it was a bit too late for them to run back. So without skipping a beat, I just said, well, this is very typical of what happens in life. Not everything always happens as we plan, so we just have to go with it. So instead of using real lays, we're going to use invisible lays of love. And that was the day that invisible lays of love was invented. So what happened was, uh, when it came time for the ceremony, the um, groom went to put the lay on the bride when he should have been putting the lay on the bride he drew a lay in the air and then put that on his bride and then the bride she actually drew a heart and she put that on her groom and they were so happy that instead of it becoming an awkward moment it actually became a very special moment and after the ceremony, her mom came up to me and she's like, I thought my daughter was going to lose it when she didn't have her lays, but you turned a very awkward moment into a very beautiful, special moment. And even the bride said that um, in the future that her and her husband, they would celebrate using invisible lays of love because now they could have that ceremony anywhere in the world. They don't have to actually have real lays and they could express their love for one another on their anniversary or on a special day by giving each other an invisible leg of love. So if anything goes wrong on your wedding day, just go with the flow. Uh, it, you know, your wedding is one day. Your wedding, your wedding is an important day. It's a special day, but your marriage is a lifetime and things don't always go the way that you plan in life. So if things go wrong, just go with the flow. You never know, something even more beautiful may come out of it. That's my story for today. Thank you for listening. If you're look, looking to get married on the island of Oahu in the state of Hawaii and would like a beautiful non-religious wedding ceremony based on your love as a couple and your journey, contact me. I'm Kim Cronella, licensed Hawaii wedding officiant, and I officiate weddings anywhere on Oahu. My website's weddingsonoahu.com. Aloha.